Hey everyone, it's Running Body. Welcome back to more Pikmin! In the last episode, we did the uh, Awakening Wood and finished that area 100%. And today we're going to be going back to the Distant Spring. And this is going to be our last visit on the uh, fourth main area because we have completed every single other area. Um, so yeah. There actually still is a few other things to do in the impact site in the distant spring after we finish getting all these ship parts. But we'll get into that a little bit later. Not really later in this episode, I mean like in a few episodes from now. Um, <clears throat> what we need to do is probably get out a lot of blues. Let's just get out a hundred blues, you know, let's just do that. Cause I think I'm trying to remember what, what the ship parts are that we need to get, but I, um, I'm pretty sure we're going to need probably blues. Well, we're going well, to need blues for every single one, but I think we mainly need blues for two of them. We'll find out. We have enough, we have enough time to get them all. I really don't know what I'm doing today. I didn't really like plan ahead. We're just winging it today. Ah, crap. You know what? I'll just do that later. Um... I see how it works for me. I was I forgot to get out some yellow Pikmin to take down that wall. I'm just gonna try to do it later and see how it works out for me. But sadly we have to fight Wallywogs one last time. Yay. Ugh, I hate these things so much. Thank you, just murder it. And we lost two to the glitch. Don't even care. Just want them dead. <laughs> I really don't care. I just want them to die. As long as I don't lose like a thousand Pikmin to it, to the glitch, then I'm fine. We lose about like two or three or so. Not really gonna be upset. Okay, I just lost one or two. Whatever. Don't care. Um, I sound so mean, like not caring about Pikmin death. It just sounds so mean. Um, you know, while they're working on that wall, let's go back and get some yellow Pikmin. We only need maybe like two. Just to hurry up and uh, get that wall down so they can bring that back. For some reason, the Pikmin do not want to go into the water. Like, the blue Pikmin do not want to go into the water when, um, when they bring that back. Which I think is stupid because they can go in the water. I don't know, maybe Nintendo just wanted it to be, like, a little bit more challenging. Don't even know what the letting them go in the water was, like, when they're carrying the ship part back. I don't know why they didn't want to do that. Okay, apparently I heard the sound for uh, that wall being brought down. Let's just get some bomb rocks. And, okay. I'm just saying, I'm the, I don't know if I said this before, but originally, every single Pikmin was going to be able to, uh, hold, uh, bomb rocks. I don't know if I, uh, said that before. Um, okay, sorry about that. I had a little bit of interruption. We were, uh, discussing dinner. <laughs> um, what just happened to... Didn't they have more Pikmin in this? I'm not even going to question right now. Um, it's my Zirconium Rotor. This is made from rust-proof Zirconium, which is particularly suited to... I can't read. Which is particularly suited to making spaceship parts. I had to pay a lot of extra to have this installed, and I suspect the mechanic overcharged me. Oh, you go back and get your money, Omar. Don't let him overcharge you like that. Okay. I swore we had more Pikmin than this. I don't know. Maybe I can't count or something. Um, that's probably it. I probably can't count. Um, <laughs> um, let's just go over here. And, uh, let's see. Um, yeah, over here we have water dumples. Let's try to possibly ignore those for now. I don't know how that's gonna go for us, but we're gonna try to ignore those. Okay, we can throw our Pikmin up here. I don't know how that's gonna work. Yeah, let's just back up a bit. I don't remember how much this needs. I think this needs about 20. So I think we're good. We ride up this thing. And... Can... Can I... Can I... Okay, thank you. And that cutscene! They got back pretty fast. Zirconium rotor, made of rust-proof zirconium, and is as shiny as new, despite being left out in this planet's harsh elements. Two more! Two can be as bad as one, but the loneliest number is the number one. Wow, just enough, because the Pikmin decided to fall down. Thanks, guys. Hey, water dumples! Hey, hey, guys. Hey, 
Hey, over here. Do not eat those Pikmin. No! Why did you try? I mean, that Pikmin wasn't it. No, 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 Oh, God, that was really close. Okay, so we got in two out of the three ship parts that we need to get today. I'm, that was just pathetic. A Pikmin just literally tripped in front of the, um, what is it? In front of the water dump. Well, that was just stupid. That Pikmin was an idiot. He, he, mm, just shame on him. Just total shame. Um, okay, we can get our Pikmin back over here. Now, I remember, now, I remember what we need to do. Um, this next ship part is a little bit of a puzzle. Not a little bit, it's, it is a puzzle. So, uh... Let's take out those water dumples because I think they could possibly cause a problem for us later. And I do not want that happening. Actually, no. Yeah, let's kill them. I am an idiot. That was my fault. I totally forgot I had yellows with me. Okay, totally my fault. Sorry, Pikmin. Okay, let's get our blues and just swim all our Pikmin on it. Hopefully not too many die. Okay, the cutscene happened at an odd time. Not gonna lie. Number two, Iron Jet. The ads for these jets boast that with excellent mileage that's easy on the family budget, this jet will keep your wife smiling and propel you to a happy home life. Kind of reminds me of a, a Happy Home Academy game that just came out, Random Crossing. <laughs> I don't know, just the uh, title kind of reminded me of it. Okay, let's throw our Pikmin up there. I don't know how many we need, but I'm just going to throw, like, a lot of them up there. Well, we're actually going to get all three ship parts at about around half of the day or so. Okay, that's definitely good. And we're gonna finally be use finally gonna be using candy pop bars. I don't even think I've ever used these in the entire let's play. Are you kidding me? All my Pikmin just literally fell down. I hate it when that happens. Let's try. I don't understand why they have to fall down. Like why? Let's throw some more Pikmin up there, because these guys decided to be bums and fall down. Thanks guys, do not appreciate that. And you guys should pay. And you will be turned into the Pikmin that are the least useful. Yellow Pikmin. That is how you will pay, even though I'm going to have to turn you back to blues anyway. Um. No, I didn't mean to pluck. Fine, I can- No! No, 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 no. No, let me just throw them over there, because they could accidentally fall down. And we do not want that. So let me just pluck these guys and just throw them over there. I do not want them accidentally, like, going to the war, and I'm not gonna be able to save them because land is too far. Like, uh, here. And we have more than enough time to, like, go crazy with this, because it, it's right, right now having some trouble here. But we have more than enough time, so I'm not stressed out by any means. Once it gets to the core of the day, though, once the core of the day is almost done, then I'm going to, uh, start getting a little antsy. Apparently I threw some Pikmin in the candy pop bar while throwing them up. Okay, still some more can go in here. I'm not sure how many more I need. I think it's about, like, 30. Come on. Okay, that's all I can do. So you guys can just... Go down there. We don't need you, you worthless things. I'm kidding, Pikmin. You guys are not worthless. You guys have helped me the whole entire way. Okay. So I gotta pluck these guys until the day is over and get that ship part over there. And then once you bring that down, you can turn them all back to blue Pikmin. Because you need um, the yellow Pikmin's height. I'm pretty sure you need about 30, but even even if we don't have... Well, we, we obviously have enough because the candy pop bud just, like, died. <laughs> so, we definitely have... Oh, yeah, we have enough. This thing does not need 40. 
Oh, I was 10 off. It actually needed it. It actually needed 20. Okay, so just bring this down. And the yellow Pikmin cannot go through water, so we're gonna have to take these guys off. I found my my Kronos reactor. Using strange new technology, this machine is able to warp the space-time continuum and turn it into energy. I am constantly amazed at how many mysteries are locked inside the parts of my ship. I'm amazed too, Olimar. You have a lot of mysteries. So let's just turn all our Pikmin back into blues. Because I don't want any of my blues being yellows. They don't deserve it. They need to go back to being useful Pikmin. I can't- I can't stand my yellows being useful. Well, I actually can't stand it because they need to be useful for once in their life, but I don't want my blues becoming not useful. And a few more. There we go. Now they're all back to normal. So I will pluck these guys. Um... And I guess, like, for the remaining time we have, I guess we can just, uh... Maybe raise up some Pikmin, possibly. I don't know what we really can do. If, we, if we're even gonna have enough time to do that anyway. Because the day just goes by super fast in this game. Like, it's almost... It's almost... It's actually starting to get closer to sunset. Just look at how fast the day is going by. I don't know why, like... I know the day is 13 minutes... But it just really does not feel like it's 13 minutes. It feels like it's lot, like it's just less than that. And I guess there go, and I guess there goes the saying: "Time flies when you're having fun." Because I am having a great time playing this game. Because I love this game. So, hmm. like when uh, when we get when uh, Bunny Boo and Ping Pong and I we all get together for a collab. Like the time just super, just it really flies because we're having so much fun just playing a game, laughing at each other, just making jokes, laughing at Ping Pong's randomness, me yelling at Sydney, Sydney yelling at me. It's just all fun. <laughs> um, so yeah, the day is almost over. We have gotten our ship part, or well, we're about to get it back, and we have raised up a little bit of blues. So yeah. Pikmin, come on. Don't wander around. Oh, let me check my map and just make sure I know where all my Pikmin are at because we don't want to leave Pikmin behind on the last day. Okay, there's a yellow over there. Let's get him. Don't know what... Oh, yeah, the bomb rocks. The bomb rock Pikmin. Um, something I wanted, I wanted to show, um, I'm pretty sure this is how it works. I think if you put in yellow Pikmin that have bomb rocks, I think they just drop them. Let's see. Yep, that's what I thought. They just drop the bomb rocks right there. <laughs> okay. And also, those of you that were curious, if you try to, like, have a Pikmin, like, grab the bomb rock that's not a yellow Pikmin, they just don't grab it. They're just like, nope, I don't want to grab it. <laughs> I don't know why, but they just don't want to grab it. Chronos reactor. This reactor changes uh, permutations in the space-time continuum into pure energy. Basically, it's like a big rubber band. I have recovered 29 out of 30 parts, increasing the dolphin's capabilities. My search can now cover a wider area. So... We have practically completed the ship. There's only one more ship part to get. But you guys may be asking, we I mean, well, you guys may be saying we have gotten all the ship parts in all the areas. There is still one more area left that has yet to be discovered. And we will find that tomorrow. And this day's about to end, so Let's just say about a distant spring. You know what I'm gonna do? Just just to say goodbye to this in spring. I'm gonna hit you in the face. Oh, you attack me, excuse me, I get more hits now. You die. And you get hit in the face too, you throat. Yeah, you can jump all you want, I'm not scared of you. 
You hit me too, I get more hits as well. Yeah, that's right. I'm not scared of you. I kinda am scared of you, but I'm not. Okay. Okay. I should really just like throw up. You know what? Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to literally throw a bomb rocket at this thing. I am so mean. Hey, hey you. Get out of the water. Get out of the water. I'm gonna throw a bomb rocket at you. Throw it, yellow Pikmin. <laughs> I almost want to kill it, but I don't want to risk losing Pikmin. Yeah, I'm not gonna. As, as bad as I want you to die, I'm not gonna risk losing Pikmin. Okay. Well, say goodbye to the distant spring, guys. Let's end the day. Go to sunset. I just love... I just love the way it looks at nighttime. It's kind of a shame that we can't play at night because of the vicious nocturnal creatures. I'm pretty sure it'll be kind of cool looking just playing at night. You know, I think it'll be kind of hard to see some enemies, like shear wings that come out of the ground and stuff. Like those things right there! You will never get my food! Mwahaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa